Welcome back to this Friday edition of Good Day. Thanks for waking up with us. And it is great to welcome comedian, Oscar winner, author, Monique, on stage this uh, weekend at the Arlington Improv, along with Tone X, yes. a fellow comedian. Yes, Thank you both for me. coming in. Thanks, Thanks for, having for having us, baby. So are you guys on tour? Is that it? Yeah. We have been touring now for how long has it been? Since we got to Earth. Okay. okay. <laughs> That's how long we've been touring. We for have years been, now. Yeah, for years, for wow. years. And, and for me, I really wouldn't have it any other way. Wow. Because, as I've said, I've graced the stages with some of the greatest comedians to ever do it. And this brother to my left is one of the greatest comedians <laughs> to ever step up on a stage. So I want you to know I love you. And I appreciate what you give to him, well, baby. Well, I want you to know I love you, too. Okay, well, Because a lot of it. things are getting off layaway because of you. Stop, listen <laughs> All right? I'm Come on, give it I'm to me. I'm king. Uh, listen, <laughs> and I'm going to tell you something about layaway, because sometimes people have a problem with layaway. Why? Because they think when you have money, you're right. not supposed to lay away. Mm -hmm. Do you know how long I laid away, baby, after I had the Parkers? I didn't realize I shouldn't be laying away till I got to the layaway. And the lady said, are you Nikki Parker? I said, yes, I am. She was like, and you wouldn't lay away? Yes. I said, yes, I am. How much I got put down, sugar? 10%. Lay Come on now. I know yeah. it. Uh, so, so Monique, uh, when you're on stage, yes. there's there's a lot of intensity. I'm always struck by that. Is is it ever difficult to to summon up the energy for that? You know what? I think because we're so passionate about what we do, when you get on that stage, you become a kid. You become that little girl or that little boy dreaming, saying, "I'm finally here." So you don't have to go somewhere and dig it up. It's always right there, and every opportunity you get. When someone says, come to the stage, mm -hmm. it's right there. How you feel? I feel yeah. great. I was going to say, I, like the tiger. Which one? <laughs> like Tony. Which one, baby? Okay, right. I, it, okay, they're not Tony, treating all our tigers Tony, good. Tony, I feel okay, great. Okay, because you got Tiger Woods. Right, well. Then you had Cecil. They don't do our that, You know how that That's went. why I said, but you like the... I'm like the, I'm like the one that's animated. Raw. You can't you, kill me. Baby Frosted. <laughs> and, and, and now, you know and, Frosted Flakes is the best cereal they ever made. Listen, you don't even need milk. You don't even Do you need milk for me? Frosted Flakes, baby. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you. Eat them right out the bowl. Have you done it? What? Have you eaten Frosted Flakes right out the bowl? Tell the truth, with... shame the devil. Yes, yes, okay, yes. I know you don't I necessarily need the milk. I can see it in your face. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, so you, like Monique, you've been you've been doing comedy a, a while as well. Do you, do you know ahead of time? that the show is just going to be great or is there always because after all it's live in the moment is there always a little bit of a doubt the show is always going to be great if i get to wake up in the morning mm. ah. and if my feet hit the ground the rest of my day is gravy so the show has no choice but to be great i get a chance to stand in front of people i get a chance to change energy in the room make people feel better when they leave than when they get there and i get to tour with this lady right here and live love and laugh with her, how can the show be nothing but great? And, and you better say did, that. Did, Mo, but that you together. said it, you I did. did. And, and Monique, one, one thing that you like to talk about, yes. relationships, how men and women relate, uh, yes. maintaining uh, domestic bliss. Do, yes. do, you feel like you, do you feel like you're on a bit of a mission? I mean, in addition to trying to get laughs? You know what, and, and let me say this to you. Great question. Because oftentimes, people don't do their homework. So what you're saying to me right now is you've done your homework. And when it comes to relationships, I've been married three times. This is my last marriage, but I, I understand the dynamic of what it takes for those two people to make that thing work. So we like talking about it in a way that's relatable and you can get it and understand it. Mm, so do we yes. talk about relationships on stage? Yeah. yeah, but in grown folks way. Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, in ways you'd understand. Ways there, you understand. There okay. is wisdom to be imparted. Mm -hmm. Guys, you thank you it? so much for uh, coming in. <laughs> Going to be you. incredible this weekend. Best of luck uh, thank you, with the baby. shows at Good the Improv. Right. We, just, right. we, we let still us had, finish. Right, baby, because we still have things to say. Right. Okay, you don't just keep talking like we're not here. See, yeah, there's the pedal here. trying to tell you, Okay. What you don't know is. Okay, there is.